you for being here today on today's episode where we will be sharing with you a grocery haul this time around will be from Walmart Risk that I'm willing to take whatever you know wrong items they bring me or the the produce if it wasn't great quality or whatever I couldn't not go um, to the grocery store I have uh, my two kids and I had tons of housework that I needed to get done today and baking and all that stuff so I could not take the time away to go to the grocery store so I decided to share with you guys my experience my grocery haul the things that I got and my experience using the delivery service also in today's video it's going to be a collaboration with amazing youtubers here that I have shared with you guys in the past different grocery hauls and we provide you with great products that they we all go grocery shopping so why not get in different ideas and different products that we have tried or it's our you know our, our my family. wonderful and just beautiful amazing friend tiffany at small town six and myself we are hosting this monthly collaboration because we figure that it's a great opportunity to share with you guys the goodies that we get as well as seeing other wonderful youtubers uh and seeing their grocery haul so without further ado let's go ahead and get started and if for any reason you guys have not seen Tiffany's channel, I will leave her channel on the description box as well as a wonderful playlist from the other collaborators on these um, monthly collabs. So let's go ahead and begin. As always, you guys, thank you so much for being part of my community here on YouTube, being a subscriber. And if you are new, don't forget to join my community, hit that thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. Leave me a comment. I love hearing from you. I love connecting from, uh, with you on the comments below. Um, and yeah, so uh, the service that we did for today, it's a delivery service straight from um, the Walmart delivery. I was going to go pick it up but then the time frame was gonna conflict with my kids nap. So I figured I was gonna take the risk and do the delivery service. And I have to say 10 out of 10. The delivery person uh, was here right on the time frame that was supposed to be here. The products were back perfectly. Um, I am not missing anything. The produce was selected properly um, and I really, really like the guy uh, who delivered my groceries called me to make sure I was home to see if it was okay to leave them by my front this door. Time around was great. So let's go ahead and show you what we got. This is the overview of all things that we have. Uh, we are a family of four. I have two boys and one is a four-year-old, four and a half-year-old. So I have a lot of their snacks and things like that. Um, this is a standard, regular thing that uh, we're completely out. So these are their snacks. This is a go-go squeeze uh, yogurt. Um, they take these like when we are traveling or we on the go and they want a snack or things like that. Um, so there's the berry, blueberry flavor, banana and strawberry. Also lately they've been on a cereal kick. Um, that's what they eat in the mornings after their yogurt. And this is like an everyday Thing. so I do have two so some of these um, will get frozen and then once they start like running low then I'll put them in the fridge in the fridge but they eat, they drink these every single morning so plus two so that's why there's so many um, and the pouches are super conveni convenient for them because they don't really need any other additional supply or a spoon and they don't make uh, you know a ton of mess of with this type of design um so this is part of their morning kind of um thing with a banana and their vitamins and things like that um i do have to say i i don't usually get pringles um my friend uh it's a youtube friend she's her name is um Mar marty um life with mar 
or Mari, <laughs> I, can't, I can't say it correctly, but she has been trying these different flavors of uh, Pringles. Um, not these, there are some really wild flavors that they have out there um, and really reminded me of how good Pringles are. So I decided to get some of this and then I also got Francisco International Extra sourdough bread my husband loves sourdough so i decided to do a loaf of that uh some honey crisp apples the kids love apples so the honey crisp apples are great for the kids snacks um and yeah just like the slices and have those for the kids and then i also have these dice ham um because i make a salad with the elbow uh, the ham and some um, vegetables with peas, carrots kind of thing. Really tasty, really easy to make and a uh, really good meal for the whole family. I got some cilantro and some avocado. The avocado is not quite ready, um, but I'm not in a rush. Um, I can definitely wait for those to get uh, ready for, for us to eat them. So. Then I got some diced tomatoes with a green chili, um, mild version because I fear these are great for breakfast things or um, I don't know, just good to have on hand. You can make them on salsa or different things. Same with the diced uh, tomatoes, garlic. Um, today is a Tuesday, so we will be making some uh, tacos with my favorite brand siete it's a grain free and actually women owned uh company so it is uh, great to be able to support women owned companies with the taco seasoning that will go on hand we'll do some ground beef um, for this recipe and i want to make some salsa hence the tomatoes and the jalapenos here and the cilantro back there um, and then we have some cilantro in addition to that because just in case one of those times that I run out of cilantro. My cilantro um, in my garden is coming back up, but I don't have enough for the salsa. So I need to use some of the fresh cilantro here. And then I, I got some black forest ham um, to have on hand. And if you guys hear some background noises, the dishwasher running, so I apologize for that. We got some strawberries, the kids love strawberries as a snack as well some bananas because we have monkeys in the house <laughs> and uh, i got some craft mayo with uh the olive oil i don't usually get these um but because uh i usually get it uh, from costco and it's with avocado oil but i actually want to do um i have tried this one before as well but um also thought that it will be just so much easier to have a squeezable kind mayo um, and yeah, so like I said, great experience with the, with the shopper at Walmart. They, he did an amazing job, uh, packaging, uh, all my goods and the delivery of it. It was a great, great experience. As you can see, the apples are in great shape. Um, no complaints there. Um, maybe the avocados, but I'm sure sometimes it's hard to get some good, peaks with avocado so i'm not uh super picky about this but overall that's my shopping haul for today you guys so i hope you guys enjoyed today's shopping haul from walmart as always i welcome you guys to be here um with my videos i I'm so, so thankful for you to come in along and just uh, watching my videos, supporting my channel. You know, I am a mom, I'm a wife, I work and I do this YouTube because I really enjoy it and I really like to connect with all of you and sharing with you bits and pieces of our life, our, our family, uh, our lifestyle and inspire you guys and give you some motivation and uh, the content I share with you guys. 
So uh, after you're done with this video, go in my description box. There will be a playlist to find more motivation and shopping ideas from other places. It might be Aldi's, it might be Walmart, there might be Costco, there might be so many grocery stores that you can find. So I hope you guys enjoy that playlist. Give this video a big thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. Also head over to Tiffany's channel. She's a great friend of mine and we are hosting this collaboration on a monthly basis. I hope you guys enjoy. And until the next one, we'll see you then. Bye-bye.